going on YouTube? Name is here bringing you guys a brand new video and today we're going to be talking about the power of right hand advantage. Now this is something that is universally known by a lot of the professional players in Call of Duty and it's actually in other FPS games as well. Um, basically in FPS games when you spawn in with your character its gun is always going to be placed in the center bottom right of your screen. So if you look at your character your gun is going to be aimed from his right hand. His left hand is holding the grip and your right hand is the one that is mantling the gun. So basically what that means is in Call of Duty whenever you cut a corner you're gonna see the guy before he sees you and part of that is due to the fact that in the coding of the of the game in Call of Duty there's a little bit of input lag and you see them always before they see you. It's been in every single Call of Duty. It was particularly the worst in Black Ops 2 but it remains in this Call of Duty and it's just one of the most important things you can utilize in your gameplay to advance yourself to the next level and become closer to being a professional player. So I thought this was something that a lot of uh, amateur players and just newer players to the scene or players who have never played competitive at all can implement into their game pretty easily and you can see quick results and go into a public match or a ranked play game and just take advantage of this and just like add it to your game and learn very quickly how to do this and I thought it'd help you guys so basically um, I'm gonna show you guys a clip of me using it in a public match and pretty much how it works against an opponent. I chose Biolab for this because there's a lot of tunnels and a lot of ways you can exploit the right hand advantage and on this clip as you can see I kill one guy, I move to the right and I see this guy so I'm gonna go ahead and actively keep peeking that corner. Now what I'm doing right there is I'm using the, the camera glitch and my right hand advantage to the best of my ability. So basically on that guy's screen he's not really gonna be able to see me very much at all. He's just gonna see like my right foot and my gun poke out. So basically, he has very little to no chance at killing me unless he has a sniper and he's going to quickscope me. So what you guys want to do is when you're playing, um, there's two ways you can you can uh, utilize this. You can either peek it and strafe it like I do. That's what I, that's what I really like to do because in case the guy does get some bullets off of me, I can evade because I'm just peeking it or I don't even have to challenge at all. But a lot of players who are uh, very aggressive, they like to just completely just turn this corner and pre-aim their way through so like it depends on where you are but for the most part you're gonna be able to just turn the corner and pre-aim and when you do that you co you're committing to it so you're gonna give yourself about a split second advantage on the opponent so if the opponent is there you're gonna 100% win that gunfight every single time given that you react you know in a decent amount of time and don't miss your shots but um, basically what I like to do, though, like I said, is I like to peek it because I like to give myself more chances, especially if there isn't a guy there. Anytime you guys are sprinting around the map and you're about to cut a corner, you should take your time, peek it for a second, and then go. Because you're going to give yourself a chance to win that gunfight, and you're not just going to blindly run into a tunnel. And yeah, so basically that's how it's going to work. I'll show you guys how you should do it on other parts of this map. Um, this is a really good map to exploit that because there's a lot of doors, a lot of corners you have to turn, and a lot of places that demand... Um, a lot of peeking so from purple coming into here a lot of people are going to be sitting this head glitch so this is a good place to uh, camera glitch it uh, here also in ice uh, this is another good place you don't want to commit to this one though because there's a lot of vantage points they have in there but this is also a good place you can test it out orange tunnel you can always do this there's just so many doors as you can see and it's so important in uh, professional esports to do this this is also something that a lot of pros just uh, have known in their subconscious and they don't actually they, they don't actually think about it when they play it's just like instinct and uh, I was talking to my friend and he actually gave me a good idea to, to do this because there's a lot of things that we do that you guys probably don't even think to do and we've been playing like I've been playing for like seven years so it's just habitual for me to do some of the things in game and not even think about it and I feel like those are the, some things that you guys need to learn that uh, we haven't really um, that, that you guys can't learn from just watching our stream and just pick up on like our small tendencies because they're just in the back of our head and we never talk about them so I thought I'm gonna make a series uh, called pro tips uh, this is obviously the first one um, if you guys did like it just throw a like and comment if you want more of these videos I hope you guys enjoyed this video as always trying to bring the best content to you guys and always improve my channel if you did just go ahead and give a like and comment and I'll make more of them this is just the first one there's a lot of more tips I can bring you guys but anyways if you guys want to check out more content go ahead and click that box in the center of the screen it'll take you to my very last video which was top five warriors of the week week seven so we're almost at the double digit mark where I'm gonna do a giveaway but anyways go check that out click that box in the center of the screen 
and I'm out, guys. Peace.